The red light is on, which can only mean one thing. We live, baby. And for the first time on the channel today, we are on Madden 21. Uh, it's been a minute since I've uploaded a video, and that's mainly because I've been grinding these solo challenges. Uh, as of this morning, September 17th, we are up to date and caught up with all of the solos in the game. Uh, we're sitting at max mutt level, and we got a million coins to play with. Before I get into the auction portion, I want to go ahead and look at the team, what we've got going so far. A lot of these players are going to be solo rewards. Uh, for example, this Trent Williams over here, 88 overall, he came from the hero set. Uh, Johnny Smith, the team builder set. I got Tyler Lockett and Tredavious White as uh, Nat from the Lamar Jackson set, which is that superstar MVP. Uh, I got these NFL epic players throughout the lineup. AP, he's been good. Fitzgerald doesn't touch the field usually because he's too slow. Andre Johnson's got, uh, he's max level because I'm at level 50. Uh, and then on the defensive side, Ryan Lott's been solid. Youngblood, I'm a fan of him. Uh, Leroy Clever, solid. And yeah, that's what we're working with so far. You can kind of see here uh, some of the power-ups. Jamal Adams, I had to pay. He was about 50% more expensive today because they just launched that uh, 90 overall limited for him. So I was a little sour about that, but we got him on the team nonetheless. Now that you're up to date with the roster that we're starting with, Let's get into that auction house, spend some coin, and I'll check back in when I'm done with that. All right, here is the completed roster. Now we spent just under a million coins and we went up two overall points. And that's kind of, that's a little surprising, I guess. I mean, a lot of the top end cards are really expensive right now just because it's the beginning of the year. Um, so I get that. But I am happy with the upgrades I make. Um, work done here. He's gonna have good speed, good upgrade over uh, AP even though use check picture showing up. Let's see if I can fix that. Nope. 
All right, so uh, yeah, he's gonna be a little bit quicker. Doesn't have the trucking, but you know, everything else is a major upgrade, especially in the catching department. So I'm happy about that, plus 10 carrying. He should be a good addition to the team. Um, running is not as powerful in this year's Madden as it was in last, but it's still effective because, you know, it's still running the ball. Uh, but then for passing, I'm really happy with my receivers. I think I've got some good, uh, some good options here. Good speed with Tyree Kill, Clayton, and Lockett. I mean, they both have uh, 89 speed and then Tyreek with 91. Uh, good deep route running. If you uh, if you get that chemmed up, which I probably need to get a little bit more training uh, to get those guys over 90 deep route. Not Tyler Lockett, obviously, but Clayton and Hill, those would be my deep threats. Um, so I'll get that worked out. And I'm happy with those guys. I think they'll be effective in the pass game. You know, it doesn't really matter necessarily how tall you are as long as you're outrunning the defenders. So what they lack in height, they make up for in speed. I'm cool with that. And then on the defensive side, I'm happy with uh, with the speed of my secondary. So I'm probably going to be playing Tredavious at the slot corner, uh, depending on what my opponent has for speedy wide receivers. But uh, Trey Waynes and Terrell both have 90 speed. That's good. That's competitive. Uh, and then Nevin Lawson and Conley both have 88, so they'll probably be my three and my four if, uh, if my opponent has some really fast receivers. Uh, and then just, you know, overall, White's got the best coverage stats. Um, but, you know, it doesn't really matter how good you are at coverage if you get burnt. So we'll see how that goes. It'll be an adjustment, but I'm happy with the, the overall speed of that secondary, and they're pretty good budget options. D-line, uh, Everson Griffin, I think he should be a good addition. He's got good stats, um, compares really well to, I think, Youngblood, you know, pretty well. Uh, let's see, what else? Von Miller, I think he'll be playing pass rush a lot because I ran a 3-4. Um, and then, you know, Mac Wilson over here, he's just kind of a budget outside backer. He's got good speed and... Comes with a secure tackler, so that's that's helpful. Um, and he'll be playing coverage because his pass rush stats are not good, as you can see there. Uh, let's see, last thing. We went ahead and bought a kicker for like our last 10 or like 10K or so that I didn't uh, record. So both of my kicker and punter have 84 kick power. That's like the best you can get without spending a whole lot at that position. It's not super important right now at the year in the year, and you know I, that's how many coins I had left to play with, so that's what I did. Uh, but yeah, there's the roster. We're in 85 overall. I hope you guys enjoyed uh, all the upgrades and are looking forward to some gameplay coming up. I think what I'm gonna do since the uh, house rules just came out today is next video will be a few games of this tug of war. Uh, game mode in house rules. So hope you guys are excited for that. Until next time, bye bye.